So audio only outlet that's can be a thing, right? They can be a thing now. You get a lot more of these and they're a lot easier for me to do. Okay, cool. Switch released or released information that subscription tiers are coming soon. And, you know, a lot of people are going off on Twitter and I'm on my hiatus from saying anything about Twitch or streaming on Twitter, mainly because I'm trying to be more zen for lack of a better lack of a better word and probably a misuse of the term but fight me. Subscription tiers, the very conversation that we're having, at least in the Crusader Discord, and I have to shout out to the Crusaders that are listening to this, because you guys uh, have proven and prove every single day that no matter what the topic, we can have a civil, a civil educated discourse about it. And thank you. And you inspired me to do this. $9.99, tiers have been announced. And I've been thinking a lot about this. And, you know, what I, what I said to the Discord, you know, in one of my very few rare large posts, I actually don't post large things in there, um, is that one, I'm not going to institute, I'm not going to let this institute a tiered system of appreciation. And I think the people that are going off on Twitter on, you know, with 140 characters going back and forth are, are saying the same thing. Um, I want you to hear this, the, the, the sincerity in my voice when I say that this community has always been about the mutual appreciation and the mutual and, and uh, equal appreciation of people that are lurkers, that are active viewers, that are subs, and then people that have been subs for a long time. And I feel like over the past three years, it'll be three years next week since I started streaming, I've, I've, I've actually taken a lot of, I've actually declined a lot of opportunities. I think somebody like Jack LaFear, whom I love dearly, would actually be, you know, pretty disappointed in some of the business decisions that I've made because of the values that I hold of, of you know, equality. And treating everybody like they have an equal part in the puzzle and equal part in this journey. And, you know, I was reading the comments on the tweet from Twitch and you just see a lot of people with such insecurity in their life. And I say that because I know it. I know that they see insecurity through a subscription, through a financial transaction that, that supposedly creates a deeper connection with the broadcaster. And I was talking with uh, with Jason, Easy Eight, that it's a dangerous road to go on when you when you link those two things together because it it creates both for the broadcaster and for the viewer this this notion that if you are not paying them, you are not important. And I want to say to you that's not the case, and that's never been the case in the in my chat. And if it ever has been, it's because of, it's because of my own insecurity. It's been a really hard journey, and I'm sure a lot of broadcasters, if you were to ask them the same thing, would feel the same way. That when we were given the sub button, we're not, you know, it's not this, this golden, plat, golden bricked road of opportunity. You look out onto that horizon, you also see a bunch of tornadoes you're going to have to, a bunch of social and mental tornadoes that you're going to have to avoid. What, you know, one of them being... This, this notion that, you know, one, out of sight is not out of mind, especially for the viewer. <laughs> Dead chats are okay, but I think that's only for me. And the fact that, you know, paying doesn't equal paying for a subscription, no matter how much that subscription is, isn't, isn't a form of, you know, showing more Uh, let me let me see if I can rephrase that. Showing more, um, you know, granting deeper connection, which is why I've had trouble. I've had Patreon open for about a week, and I'm like, I'm gonna revamp my Patreon, right? And Patreon tier. I've been looking at so many Patreons from other uh, other broadcasters, and you have this tiered system. You pay me more, you get more. 
you get what you pay for, right? It's the, it's the flip end of that. And I have had so much trouble with that. In the same vein, I'm not going to activate tiered emotes. I'm not. Because I don't, I, I cannot, I cannot stand the thought of seeing only people that have paid 25 bucks using emotes when, you know, they're, they're a community member as the same way as any other community member that has paid. The fact that people are calling this pleb sub, 499 pleb sub, uh, it's like, it, it's, it's just this vast rife insecurity that, you know, all of a sudden they're going to be worthless. And I want to know, I want you guys to know, at least for this community, at least for the Crusaders, at least for the people on Twitch, at least for the people that know me and a lot of other communities on Twitch, that that is not the case. That will never be the case. And that if it ever becomes the case that you call me out on it, because you do, you do pay for, you know, you do pay and you do invest your time. Time is money. Cliche, cliche, cliche. You have something to feedback, you give feedback, give feedback on your, on your broadcaster to your broadcaster in a, in a civil manner, of course, and not one filled with, with hate and ignorance. At the end of the day, all I want, I don't, I'm not, you know, all of a sudden wishing for 2000 subs. That's half truth because, of course, it'd be great if that happened, and I was able to keep the same, the same integrity and genuine and the same genuine community that we've had at 280 and 300. I want to carry that on, and somebody like Snowlit is an amazing example of being able to do that. But at the end of the day, I want to be able to not go from paycheck to paycheck doing this. And the proof shows that the higher sub numbers are what gets you there. And two, that I can allow, I can allow Jen to stop being the, the, the force that keeps the boat afloat. Uh, because she's in a, in a period where I, like she wants to go on to what's next. And we're still at a point on Twitch where it feels like if we were to pull her out of that, that the ship would sink a lot faster um, than, than otherwise. The runway would just disappear. That's the reality of the situation. And you'd think with that impetus that I would be like doing all of these tiered things. I'd be getting sponsorships here and there. I, you know, I, I'd be better with money and things like that. But no, I am, I am Brian. I am Brian and I will always be Brian. The Brian that you see on cast. The Brian that you see in the out with it. This is my brand. This is who you get. Hopefully, we'll see good things come out of this. And I know in this community, we'll see good things come out of the subscription tiers. This is definitely a great thing for partners that I'm glad that Twitch is doing. I'm glad that Twitch is allowing to happen. And But again, I will swear to you, and call me out if this ever changes, that you will always be an equal card-carrying crusader no matter what status you hold in this community. I love each and every one of you for spending your time with little old me, some of you every day for the past three years, and some of you just yesterday. And I hope to have that support in the days to come, no matter what changes, we can weather anything. And now more than ever, I believe that. So thank you. And I hope you enjoyed this. I'll see you when I see you. Love you guys.